For this problem, we're given the information that it took 4.5 minutes for one liter of helium to effuse through a porous barrier. And we're trying to figure out how long it will take for one liter of chlorine gas under identical situation um, to effuse. So first thing we want to do is actually change this into um, milliliters per minute, or liters, sorry, liters per minute. So we're going to take the one liter divided by 4.5 minutes, and we get that that is 0 0.22 liters per minute. Okay, and now we can use our equation. So 0 0.22 milliliters per minute for helium. We don't know what our rate for chlorine is going to be, but it's going to equal the molar masses of both. Um, and so we're going to put the molar mass of chlorine on top, which is going to be um, 70.906, uh, because it's two times the molar mass of chlorine, which is 35.453. And then divide that by the molar mass of helium, which is 4.003, um, squaring both sides, or actually we don't even need to square both sides, we can actually just do the math here, and we'll get that um, 0 0.22 divided by our rate of effusion for Cl2 equals 4.21, um, and when we solve for this rate, we will get we will get that our rate is 0 0.52 liters per minute. Um, so we have the rate, but we're trying to figure out how long it's going to take for the one, the full liter to go across. So we can just set this up as a proportion for one minute equals 1.0 liters divided by x minute. Okay. And we'll have 0 0.52 times x minutes equals 1.0 liter minute. Um, and that when we solve for x, we get that x is 19 minutes.